Hey everyone, it's Archon here and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a Minecraft server on the Java Edition without port forwarding or in other words with Hamachi. So first thing you're going to do is head to this site which will be linked in the description and you're going to want to hit this first Minecraft server 116.4 jar and it's going to download and it's going to say this is harmful and you're going to hit keep and then you just drag it to your desktop. So I already have it out here, it says it has a little one next to it because I already have a server but you're just going to have another folder right next to it and you can name it whatever you want like for example right here I have play the island because I don't know that's just what I decided to name it and you're just gonna drag it in there it's already in there actually so you know what this can just stay out here for now so in here we have our executable jar file if it doesn't say executable jar file that means you don't have the latest version or at all of Java you're gonna need to go download that there are plenty of YouTube videos on YouTube that will help you with that so you should be able to find that relatively easy so the next thing you're gonna do is just double click it and it should create some folders there we go we have our EU LA and then you're gonna go onto here backspace and set it to true let's file and then save to lock it in then you're gonna go back to the executable jar file and you're gonna double click it once again and this time it'll create some more folders all right guys now you can see that this little screen has popped up this is the little control panel for your minecraft server so right now it is actually loading up the world so So there you go, it's ready, and we actually don't really need to look at this right now. So to stop your server, make sure to always type in stop into here, and it will just shut down and automatically close. It's really convenient. Next, you're going to want to go to server. It should say properties file. If not, it'll come up with a screen that says go to Microsoft Store to open it, and just say open in another way, and select no editor, and when you actually go into this you're gonna see a lot of different things but the only thing that we're gonna actually be focused on is the server IP down here so there are a lot of other settings on this such as spawn protection there's allow nether there's difficulty spawn mobs PvP etc so if you need somewhere to change that kind of stuff this is the place you need to be and now moving on to the second part we need to go back into Chrome and actually go to Hamachi so the address for this is vpn.net but once again I will link it down in the description and you're just gonna hit download now it's gonna go here and you're just gonna follow a fairly simple procedure to just launch any app very simple you just have to click continue continue and finish and after that you will get log me in Hamachi and it should look something similar to this so after that you have to hit this power on button and since I already have it set up and my account it'll say pro being and go but for you it's gonna say create a network or join and you're gonna hit create now after you create you're just gonna have to make an account once again super simple very basic stuff and after that it's gonna prompt you to create a network so right here it'll look something like this and all you have to do is make a new network so I'm gonna call this let's say doesn't matter you probably want to name it something simple just so you can add your friends really easily and then we'll call it we'll, we'll name the password like and we're gonna hit create so it should create it right here and there we go we have our own network where people can join so Next, what you want to do is go up to this top area and it says copy IPv4 address and you're going to want to copy that. You're going to want to go into your notepad and then you're going to go to server IP and paste it there, no space, just how it's formatted. And after that, you're going to hit file and save. After that, your Minecraft server is actually set up completely. 
all your friends have to do is get Hamachi, log in with the stuff you made, like this is the ID and I made a random password, give them that long in info, and then all they have to do is input this IPv4 address into their Minecraft servers and they will be able to join your server. Now, here's where I struggled. A lot of times I have been struggling to set up these servers and I've been taking hours and hours to figure out why because I can join the server but my friends, it gives them this error called refused connection. So there's actually a fix to this. What you're going to want to do is go to control panel and you're actually going to go to windows defender firewall, you're going to go to advanced settings and it'll come up with this weird screen next you're gonna go to outbound rules I made a mistake and you're actually gonna hit port click next TCP is fine and you're gonna enter 25565 next allow the connection next and name it TCP you're gonna click finish and go back into new rule you're gonna go back to port this time select UDP type in 25565 next allow the connection next next and name it UCP and you're gonna press finish the reason I'm not pressing finish is because I already have it and I don't want to mess with it after that you can just hit the X on all of these tabs load up your server and I guarantee it will work as long as you have no firewalls up. If you want to see another firewall video covering how to disable it, leave it in the comments below. I will consider it and make a video for you guys. Yeah, just make sure to use the comments. Make sure to like, subscribe if you're new to the channel because more quality content like this will be coming out soon. Hope this helped. Have fun on your server. Peace out.